another episode of Crazy Town Gaming. My name is Jonas. I'm your host, and I'm here with TNT Dynamite, the explosive one. I'm the man on the stick. He's holding the stick, and folks. we're coming from Maryland. We're going to save her and whatever she do We're going to do things because she had no one else to go to. Exactly. I'm not going to besmirch her this time by saying no to You know to what would besmirch me? What? If all these fine folks didn't hit that subscribe button and ring a ding ling 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 that notification bell. <laughs> That's that would, it. That would be helpful, I suppose. Yeah, yeah I'd like I'm it. coming. I'm coming, girl. That horse is oh Excuse so me, motherfucker. Keep it moving. I'm fucking what? Okay. Oh, shit. I'll just go around. I'll go <laughs> around. I'll be the bigger man. Where's your gold yeah. shotgun? Arthur. Oh, Arthur. Shit, you're right. Up here. You came. Yeah. I came. So, uh. What do you need? Wait there. I'm coming straight down. How did you afford this room? What you looking at? <laughs> your penis? Um, excuse me? That's what they're looking at, your penis. <laughs> oh, he's like, let me check my tooths. <laughs> Arthur. Hello, Mary. You came. Uh, sorry, I well, didn't Mary make it. it when last you wrote. Uh, oh, Arthur. What's wrong? Daddy. Your father? I'm a bigger fool than I even thought. I'm begging you, Arthur. I know Daddy was not kind to you, but, but surely you cannot hate a man for the sin of loving his daughter and wanting better for her than... Than, than me? Than the choices you what make. What choice did I have? Did I ever have? Oh, I know. You had to live by your code. But your code is... Well, it's not right. Has your way been right, Mary? With you? And Jamie joining a bunch of crazies? And hypocritical daddy with his drinking and whoring and gambling? Huh? Wow, is that what your life has gotten you? Begging me for help? Oh, Arthur. Be kind to me. Please. I'm sorry. I am. I should have asked someone else. Yeah, probably. But, but I'm the best yeah, guy you absolutely know. Absolutely, you should have. people. It wasn't that I didn't love you, Arthur. You know that. Mm. Oh, Arthur. We were so very young. Think how different life could have been. Yeah, I think about it. A lot. It all seems so long ago and far away now. Will you help me try to save Daddy? Hmm. Only if you call me Daddy. Well, help her this please. time, dude. X. You don't know way. how bad I want to say no. You really don't. She's big. Look, Jonas. She begged really you once, you said lot. no. My heart of hearts. Is telling me to say no. It's automatically doing yes. yes. I am aware of that. Not I'm him. contemplating still. Fuck. For the video. So you will? God damn it, Joe. No. You I, should you should go and then when you find her dad, kill him. What's the old lovable patriarch been up to now? Oh, Arthur. You know sarcasm is beneath you. He's been gambling and drinking and other things. Uh, why am I doing this? Oh, the filthy rotter. You gotta help someone who doesn't need or him? want help. He said he was going down to the Theodore Eckhart stables. Kill him. Something about a horse. It's down Kill by the, the horse. in the warehouse Kill district him. near the train Bring yard. his dead body back to Come her. Come on, then. Don't be a pompous ass, Arthur. It doesn't suit you. Oh, should I leave that to Daddy? Leave Daddy alone. He suffers enough. Well, I suppose I can take some consolation in that. No, oh, Arthur. I should have ran away with you years ago. Oh, now she's trying to virtually S D. No, I didn't. But, well, I don't know. Lady, you already said yes. This is fucking stupid. <laughs> I'm mad. I'm mad. What the fuck? Okay, bitch, what are you, I mean, Why cool. is she riding side horse on it? All right, Shoot whatever. Her. Can you kill her? Jonas. <laughs> I'm not going to kill her. Oh. Where's my double? Oh, that's the other double barrel shotgun. There's my pump action. 
And my car So what do you think he's up? Ooh, that's the pretty I'm one. Sure. Yeah. He keeps saying it's a disgrace, a man of his standing her to get her dad. Why is she nag? riding on the side like that? Standing. She's usually Weird. falling it's down. Ride. Arthur. Is it? He way. wasn't always this way. But it has got worse. He's drinking and gambling more than ever. Pawning things off left and right. Mixing with bad people. I'm just scared for him. Don't worry too much. Whatever it is, we'll work it out. Oh, God. Dude, I'm not a sap in real life. It's hard for me to be a sap in a video game. <laughs> like, doing good is one thing, but being a fucking sap, like, the fucking dynamite in me is like, I would have been like, be gone, thought. <laughs> <laughs> like, really hard. Be gone, thought. Are you the daddy? Are you the daddy? Let me go in Where's and daddy? see what kind of a state he's in. Sure. I'll wait here. Good luck. Dude, this, this bitch is running a fucking Very game funny. on me. She is. Look at her butt. You can't stand there. What, in the street? Yes, in the street. Is it your street? Just get out of here. Well, Why? I'm gonna have to beat your ass. I said, just get out of here. Oh, he's tough. Listen, partner. I'm waiting on a lady. She's a fine lady. She's just gone inside. <laughs> if I wasn't waiting on this lady, you'd be dead already. But if you continue Woo! to irritate me, <laughs> I'll kill you. I make my apologies to the lady. It's your call. Oh, I didn't mean nothing. Never been so to me in my life. Apology accepted. Oh, my own wait daughter. right there. I have half a mind to kill you myself. Daddy. No. Oh, Daddy, kill please him. come home. You're tired, Daddy. Tired and I am no such thing. You get away from me. You head home. I insist upon it. Nope. Leave me be. There we go. He made his decision. Excuse me, partner. Still oh, you're going to beat ever. the shit out of him. Oh, Arthur, he's up to no good. We better follow him. Okay. All right. Fine, All right. I fine. I can't help, man. She does have some cakes. She has some cakes. Yeah. This you, way. You wouldn't have been gone her? Does it say I have to? He pull out a gun and shoot him? Keep your distance. No. Can't pull out a gun and shoot him, Jonas. I'm not going to do it anyway. Why? Because if I do that, it'll just make the mission longer. Oh, I feel you. Some people can't handle the liquor. What the fuck are you Don't looking at, buddy? Oh, you know. Oh. All right, so. Okay, well. Hold on. You can see why he has such a high opinion of himself. Jesus. He's a looker. We'll just follow the smell. Arthur, <laughs> come on. Did he poop his pants? No, but he, he puked right here. Just between those crates. See? Oh, <laughs> God, what did he eat? Fucking. <laughs> I know. What is neon green? Especially in 1899. Come here, huh. quick. Mind Ooh. where you go. Mind where you go. Oh. Sorry. I'm pressed up against Closer her a than ever. Bit. Do you think he saw us? I don't think so. Uh, Excuse the erection. I didn't say anything <laughs> insulting. She's oh, like, is that a beef fuck. summer sausage in your pocket? Or, uh... Ain't you a little old for brawling, mister? Damn you! Mm-mm-mm-mm. Gross. <laughs> Why is he gross? What's He's gross heading across the road. He's vomiting you know, and stuff. This is kind of fun. Shh. He'll hear you. No, he you won't. He's drunk as fuck. a bit. I didn't realize I was here to impress anyone. Now, you're acting like a damn fool. Don't mind me, I'm just staring at this box. I saw where What's he, he went. Let's go find out. What is hey, he doing in the alley? What's your guess? You're too close. My guess is heroin. <laughs> Maybe. It's a little trail mission. Or he's selling himself. I played for Assassin's Creed. 
<laughs> I don't know why you ate that game. I don't like stealth, bro. Well, I'm not really stealth. I'm just this is like a stealth. common. This is a common rock star trope. And I hate all of it. <laughs> Anytime I have to slowly do anything, what's he doing? I don't dig it. What do you think he's doing? Well, he's either waiting for a woman of dubious morals. Oh, a whore. So, so, Ashton, you got the money? So oh, he owes somebody. somebody. Have you got the brooch, Mr. Gillis? Yes. Oh, shit. Yeah. He's selling black tar heroin to the highest bidder. Here's the money. Or a brooch. What? Ooh. <laughs> That's some disrespectful <laughs> shit right there. That is beautiful. <laughs> it's a family heirloom. That was it's mother's brooch. Years. Not any longer, Mr. Gillis. Enjoy the money. And should you need any more, I can offer you a loan at a very reasonable rate of interest. No, thank you. I've heard what happens to folks who take loans from you. Ooh, they get to sell. Oh, it's just a brooch. At least he didn't get himself killed. You don't understand. Mother left it to me. You sold my mother's Are you brooch? How could you? You fucking women, dude. That's theft. No offense to any of the women oh, out there. Speaking I love of you. thieves, I, I see you found your outlaw again. Hello, sir. Have you been well? Daddy. Have you How been well, you? sir? Mary, oh, you gotta go buy the brooch the back. Brooch. I don't think don't so. Don't hurt anyone, Arthur. Here and go fuck somebody up for the brooch. All right, someone. catch up with the buyer. Like Give me this brooch or I'll kill you is what you're going to say. You're either going to be able to threaten him or just take it. Hey, you, Ashton, hold her right there. Why is he running? I don't know. Oh, shit, you got to jump on the back. Oh, what made you look like a bee? I can't take that horse. Where's my horse? I guess I should have just taken why this horse. Did, yeah, you, why did you run to it and then say you... Because I didn't think it was the right horse. That's thought I might get a, like, a charge for stealing a horse. That's why, all right? Uh, okay, you don't want to be charged. Get back here! What do you have to do? Cut him off at the pass? I don't know. I don't know what I have to do at all, actually. Do I just, like, jump to his wagon or some shit? My horse is not coming. No, no, no. They intend for me to use this horse. God, yeah, I'm sure. I don't like it. I like my horse. Your horse, you mean? Yes, I like your horse. Damn it, Jonas. It's fine. I like your horse. I like your horse. Oh, my God. I like my other horse. Dude, I'm out of stam on this horse. This horse is trash. You, like, got close, and then you're just watching them drift away. This horse is garbage. It's a garbo horse. It's all about angles, man. All right, I got a little angle on them here. Jump it. Let's Jump. see if I can. Jump! What the hell? Oh, jack the wagon, it says. <laughs> Excuse me, sir. And you too. Drive to a secluded spot. No, you gotta keep going. Okay, you're right. Oh, he's just gonna stay in there, huh? This is insane! That's your best bet. Oh god, you're gonna fucking Dude, he's got four horses on this thing. Four horsemen of the apocalypse. All here. this horsepower. Ha! <laughs> Get it? Where are you it's taking a four me? horsepower wagon. Where am I taking him? Uh, to the left. To the left. But there's like water and stuff. Oh, I guess I can just go over it, huh? I bought that road fair and square. <laughs> I don't want another dead horse fiasco, <laughs> Joe. Another incident. I still have nightmares from the last one. <laughs> Get Mars Brooch. Why did he not jump out when you didn't pull out? Get out of there! Oh, Leave you just threw him in the mud. Leave me alone! It's just a brooch. I want that brooch. It wasn't Gillis's to sell. I bought it fair and square. All right, let's pull out a bigger How much gun. What you want for? <laughs> I guess I could give it to you for a hundred dollars. Beat him. Uh, Beat him. Yeah. A hundred? What do you take me for? Okay, okay. Uh, I'm a reasonable man. Let's say 50. Mm. Uh, not good enough, Ashton. Okay, Jesus. Twenty-five dollars, that's my Are you gonna kill him offer. anyways? Uh, how about it? 25 bucks. I want to be. Kill him? I'm a reasonable man, yeah, Jonas. Take the damn thing. Crazy son of a bitch. Can you tie him up? You don't know who you're messing with. Excuse me? Somebody's gonna pay for this. Excuse me? Did I kill him? Is he dead? 
<laughs> I mean, you punched him in the face. I don't. Know. I mean, yeah, no, I said I even got my money back. Plus, plus eight, <laughs> plus three dollars. Yeah, dude. Fuck. Wait. Okay. If he got no, no, he gave money away to the other guy. Okay. Yeah. 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 And that was the last time old Moneybags, the loan truck, was ever seen again. He was left to his demise in the swamp. The gators will get him, if you know what I mean. <laughs> I just hit him in the face. It was like I lost rank for that. I don't know why. I was just going to punch him a little bit. He'll show him. Where's your father? I don't know. You want me to go find him again? Not really. Oh. Why don't you take a walk? Looks like you're gonna need me back take in your to life. Charlie. Thank you. <sighs> By the uh, way, got you your brooch back. I won't need to pay me back that twenty five bucks. Probably best not. Hey, what are you doing now, right this moment? Why'd you ask? Well, I was he wants a little wondering taste. if you wanted to do well, something. Well, Arthur Longborough Beard, theater, if you know what I mean. Perhaps. Uh, the theater. Now you can do it. Theater? Me? Joan, we're already too deep now. Sure, why not? It's already too fun, deep. So deep, Arthur, so deep, let's so deep. go to the Relure. They have the strangest acts. <laughs> strangest I can handle. Well, it's the normal business of life. I can't seem to get a grip on it. <laughs> you and me both, Arthur. Oh, shit. Oh, I've missed you. Don't start. <laughs> You're an idiot. But you'll always be my friend. Well, of course I'm your and friend. And let's press that B button. You ain't always fair with me. Told you. If I was fair with you and a good person, I'd have had you hanged a long time ago. Well, that's true. <laughs> so, shut up and act like a gentleman, or at least try to for once in your brainless life. You're not well, a very I nice woman. Get away with that. <laughs> what? Well, look at the company I keep. I know talking it's quite dreadful, shit. isn't it? <laughs> what, you, what do you mean talking shit? <laughs> sort of beautiful, in a gaudy and tasteless way. It's the only way I know. <laughs> Thank you. Well, no, I didn't mean it like that. I... I'm sure. <clears throat> you silly man. <sighs> Come on. God let's forbid go find you say anything seats. about her, though. <laughs> Damn. Oh, what kind of show are we going to watch? Uh, off camera, that? I have already sure. watched some of these. After you. Oh, really? Yes. How? Uh, oh, just in the theater in general? Yeah, you can just go to the theater and just pay to go and sit down. Oh, nice. Now you got it. Now you have a date. <laughs> yep. Welcome! <laughs> and thank you for that thunderous applause. I am Aldridge T. Abington, the How greatest assembler that? of entertainment. Since Nero himself, we'll watch, we'll watch one and then I'll get up. As a child, oh, when I sounds walked good to me. the horse manure covered streets of Saint Denis, I never dreamed of the stir I would create so, in this locality. Just as a starting or not. Are you in a rush? The greatest show <laughs> yes. ever assembled. Prepare for the grandest excitement of your curiosity. Fire, this is the best. and magic. <laughs> I encourage any of you to dabble in all three if you have a settled aversion to manual labor as I do. For entertainment what? is a gift that will see you through the winter better than any packed larder or root cellar full of canned goods. Now, ladies and gentlemen, please welcome a truly stunning musical performance to the stage. Oh, a musical Miss performance. Robin and on that note, I'm probably going to have to get up or we'll get content ID back. Oh, yeah. Get up out. Let me here. hear what song it is. We'll see. I might have to get up, though. Hey, yeah. Come on. Let's get out of here. Oh, thank you for joining okay. us. Woo. Now, let's if talk you a little bit Reckon about... Reckon we've seen the best of it. Oh, cool. <sighs> Yeah, I don't want to get content ID match for that. <laughs> yeah, I mean, All right. 
You better take me to the trolley now, Mr. Morgan. No, that was a suitable enough date for Quite her, though. Ridiculous. <laughs> she, you sat down, the show started, off. and you're like, Sorry. okay, let's go. <laughs> My Never life a wasn't supposed on the trolley. to. A blow J on the trawl. Oh. A blow Is blow on the trawl trawl. Arthur. I can't lie to you. I'm a wanted man, Mary. If I, if anyone close to me, well, they're wanted too, and I can't have you wrapped up in there. But it's coming to an end. This time it really is. Run away with me, Arthur. Run away right now and don't look back. He ain't giving up on to. Dutch. Goddamn right. Isn't anything I want to. But I've got some people I need to take care of. Once they're free, then I'm free. Then I can disappear. But Arthur. If we're gonna run away anywhere, we'd need money. Soon, oh, sure. I'll have some. I know you won't run away. Uh yeah, that's true. I'm not leaving Dutch. But it's a pretty nope. dream. Very pretty, but I will once I get some money. And I had some, but then some fool got it trapped into a town that I can't go back to. That's another story. I'll write you. Yeah. Yeah, bye. See ya. <laughs> Later. Thanks for paying me to help you with your deadbeat dad. Right? You had to pay money to just send her on the trolley. Yeah, right. Every time you take out a woman, it's like minus $50 out of your real life money ticker. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm talking about. I was thinking about this the other day, Jones. I was like, God damn it. Every time I leave the house, it's to spend fucking money. I mean, that's kind of kind of what happens. I mean, yeah, but it's fucking How annoying. Oh shit, we're getting down over here. Is that Robert E. Lee? I'm offended. Alright. Is it Robert E. Lee? I'm offended. <laughs> what? You're not? Fuck Robert E. Lee, he's a prick. <laughs> I don't know what he did. He was the leader of the Confederacy. Was he? No, that was Jefferson Davis. Are you sure? He was a Confederate general, though. Yeah, he was one of those things. He was like one of the most prominent ones, I think. He like did slave things though, so he's a dick. Yeah, that's Douche never bag. that's never what you want to do. Slave things, yeah. No. <laughs> slave things, no, yeah, dude. Never, slave things are bad. You definitely don't want to do those. I am going to head over to the uh, the doctor. No, I don't want to go to the doctor. <gasps> Off camera, Joan. I can't even tell you because it would be it piss people off. Where the fuck is the tailor at in this town? My, I'm gonna go over to the tailor and get a new set of clothes. Ooh. Um. Yeah, I don't know, man. Like, there's not enough time to really do anything of substantialness. Right. So we're just gonna walk over to the tailor together, and we're gonna talk about uh, my weekend. Okay. I stayed home and played video games. It was great. The end. Awesome. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> These are the things I do. I also learned some new words, uh, surreptitiously. Oh, did you do that? Yes. Yeah, <laughs> you sat around and learned new words thank, and played thank, Red Dead Online? <laughs> Thanks for the engaging banner there, Jonas. <laughs> what, what is it? I don't know what surreptitiously <laughs> is. What the fuck you want from me? Yeah, well, you're going to have to look it up. If you put surreptitiously in the, the comments below, Jonas will uh, eat a picture of you every day. <laughs> Every day. <laughs> a small picture of you will be eaten by Jonas. That is not true. No, dude, it's going to happen. Watch. All right, Jonas, that's the end of the episode, No, man. I'm looking this shit up. No, <laughs> it's not necessary. It gives him something to do at home. And plus, I can't find my way in here. I got to eat something because I'm really No, I'm fucking now. putting it up. Serotipus? Serotipus. <laughs> <laughs> Surreptitious. Yeah, surreptitious. Something that's done in secret or is kept quiet. Yeah, like when I 
sneak into your bedroom and <laughs> watch, me, watch me sleep and stand over you with a knife in my hand and just breathe heavy, hoping I wake up so you can. Oh, so my God. The moment you wake up, it's over. Because, I mean, I, how can I even answer for myself at that point? You're yeah, you're like so embarrassed. You just have to stab oh, like you're like, oh, you shit, I've been gazing. How the fuck do you get in here? Hello. That is the end of the episode, you. though, for real. Okay. That is all the time we have for today's episode. Please make Let sure to like, share, and subscribe. We also have a podcast and some other game playthroughs on the channel. Well, check them out. Lie to your friends. Tell them it's worthwhile to sub. We will uh, give you a high five if we ever meet you in person. And, uh, ooh, I like that vest. It's very uh, St. Denis. is a local flavor. <laughs> but for Jonas, for TNT Lavender Mite, <laughs> we... R. Oh. Ooh. Swanky. People around here come in.